going to make a small piano today. This one is in 1 to 144. And before I can make it, I am going to make some research. And I found the length of this piano. I'm dividing that with the 144. And now I have the length for this miniature piano. And I'm going to draw it down so I have the shape that I want to. I rolled out a piece of black clay on one of my smaller setting on the pasta machine so this is not that thick and then I am going to cut out the shape of the piano. I then cut out some really thin strips that I am going to put around this piece that I just made. I'm placing one of the strips starting like two or three millimeters uh, in, then going around and ending two or three millimeters before the end. Then I'm going to take half of one of these uh, stripes that I made. I want it to be the same height as the one I just placed on the piano. And I'm going to place that in between the two ends of the first piece. I hope you understand, otherwise just watch what I'm doing. After baking, I rolled another piece of black clay through my pasta machine in the same thickness as the other one was. I'm going to cut out the lid for the piano. Remember, it's not supposed to go out over the keys. Then I made a decorative edge around the top of this lid. Remember to do it on the right side of the lid. I rolled another piece of black clay out in the same thickness as before and this time I'm placing it double. And I'm going to cut out uh, three small strips here and these are going to be the legs for the piano and then I am going to make the piano chair also. This is a really easy way to make that one. I took a small piece of white clay and I rolled it into a very, very thin cane and I'm going to use that to make it look like there is some uh, strings or so in the piano itself. Then I rolled a piece of white clay through my pasta machine on the thinnest settings that I have and I cut a tiny piece that fits for the piano's keys. I am putting that on there and making these small indents to show that this is piano keys. I glue the lid on to this piano so that it is standing a bit open. So the next part here is a bit dangerous. I'm going to cut each side on the three legs a bit into a uh, small angle so they are big at the top and small at the bottom. And then I am going to sand them all. And when I'm ready, I am going to glue them on to the uh, piano on the back side, just like you see me do here. After it has dried a bit, I am going to take some black citadel paint and I'm going to make some tiny details here on the keys for the piano. And I am actually also uh, painting the legs to make them all black again after my sanding. I'm painting the top of the little stool red. 
When the paint is all dry, I am going to take some of my UV resin glaze and I'm putting a very thin layer on top of the piano and the stool and I'm going to place it in my UV light for around 4 minutes and that's it. It's now all done. This was a fun little miniature to make. I had a lot of fun. Thank you for watching. Please give the video a like and remember to subscribe. Happy crafting!